Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm unboxing my last Miss to Mrs. box. Um, if you've been keeping up with my wedding series, this is my third box that I've gotten from the Miss to Mrs. subscription box. Um, if you haven't seen those videos, I'll make sure that they're linked down in the description and then up in the cards somewhere. I've had so much fun filming these unboxing videos and just sharing everything that Miss to Mrs. has to offer. I've had my opinions on the boxes, but I definitely think that it was a great investment. A lot of the stuff that are in these boxes are very useful for each bride on her wedding day. With all that being said, let's go ahead and get into the video. So same thing as usual. Um, let's see, it has the famous Miss to Misses on the front. And okay, so this one, when you open it, there's no paper like the other one. So um, this is what the box looks like when you open it. Right off the bat, I can already see there's a hat in here. So let's go ahead and open this. I don't know why this is so hard to open there we go okay i guess you get a ponytail too that's nice this is like one of those straw hats that you can wear out on the beach and what does it say it says happily ever after on it um it's funny i was actually gonna buy one of these back when we were getting married in august because it was gonna be summer and it's gonna be hot wherever we went but um this will definitely come in handy when we do go on our honeymoon and I can just wear it out. Let me see, I'm gonna try it on. This is the back. Oh, I don't know. Let me see, let me fix the camera. So, <laughs> that's what it looks like. I'm sure it'll be cuter on me once I have like my hair down. This is really cute and it's like the perfect floppy hat. I don't know, since I have my hair like half up, half down, it kind of doesn't look right, but it's really cute. I definitely, if I were to buy my own, I would have got a darker shade of like tan or brown just because that matches the type of color that I like. This is going to be really cute once we're able to go on vacation and hopefully we go somewhere where it's summertime because I can just see myself sitting on the beach with this hat and just relaxing. So definitely look out for all the cute pictures that I'll hopefully be posting in the future on my Instagram. Also, if you don't follow me on Instagram, I'll make sure it's on the screen here and linked down below as well. Next up. We have knee-high tube socks, and they say just married on them, so they look like that. That's so cute. Oh, I love that. It has a little heart. I am a sucker for long socks, so this is definitely going to come in handy. Next up. Oh, it's a passport and luggage tag set. This is cute. So this is the luggage tag, it just says let's go on it. I love that it has the rose gold details on it, I think that's so pretty. And then it has a passport holder and it says and so the adventure begins. I don't have a passport already so I have no idea what goes in which pocket. But this is so cute and like it's really sturdy, it's like really good material. Um, and it has a pocket on the side here and then this flap opens here so when I do get my passport this is where it'll be. Lavelle and I do want to travel so this is going to come in handy and I was going to get my passport before we got married but I figured it would be kind of a waste of time because I'm going to have to change my last name anyways and I have to change all my documents so I didn't get it, my passport and it worked out because I wasn't going to be able to go anywhere anyways in 2020 but um yeah, I'll have my passport and then I'll have a book to go with it and a luggage case. Oh, this is so cute. This is probably like my favorite thing that I've gotten so far out of all of the boxes that I've gotten. Next up, oh, it's a pink flamingo floaty for the pool. That's cute. We don't have our own. Oh, it's a drink holder. So that's probably why it's so small. I was looking at that like, why is this so tiny? But it's a drink holder. So that's really cute. Um, another thing, if we're on a vacation or we're at a friend's house that has a pool, I have a drink holder now and it's portable. I can take it wherever I want. I love that. We have, oh, it's a waterproof phone case bag thing. I needed one of these. We I went to Lake Havasu like a while ago and I was so scared to hold my phone because I didn't have anything to like hold it in. But now I have a waterproof case. I see why they call this the honeymoon box because all of this stuff is like honeymoon related. The waterproof bag because when you're in the ocean or if you're, I don't know, you're probably somewhere on a beach. So you have a waterproof bag, the hat, the drink holder, the passport. This is, this was a good box. This is by far my favorite box yet. I wonder if this will fit my phone though. It looks pretty big to fit my phone, but it might squeeze a little bit because this is the top of the, um, the waterproof bag. So I don't know. We'll see. But I really like this. This would be really helpful when we do get to travel. 
Okay, next up we have, I don't know what this is. Oh, it's a bag. And it says Vanderlust. I don't know what that says. I think that says Vanderlust, Wander, Wanderlust, Wander, Wanderlust, whatever that means. I don't know what that means. If you know what that means, let me know. <laughs> but it's just a bag, like a little bag. What are these called? I think these have a specific name, drawstring bag. I don't know, but it's just a bag that looks like that. It has flamingos on it. Um, I guess that's a thing for brides on vacation. I don't know. That's cute. All right. I think there's only a couple. Oh no, I think there's only one more thing in here. Oh, let me see. It's a door hanger. Just married, don't even think about knocking. Honeymoon in progress, do not disturb. Okay, so it's a two-sided uh, door anchor that just looks like that. The one side says just married, don't even think about knocking. And the other side says honeymoon in progress, do not disturb. I think that's a cute little saying, adorable. Okay, so that was the last thing that was in the box. If you guys have watched my other two videos, you know that I had to like throw out the card that's usually on the top that tells you everything that's in the box, but this time they put it on the bottom. So that was really helpful. I would have preferred that they did that with every single box because some people don't want to ruin the surprise. But um, as always, this has everything that's in the box on this card. And then they gave me two other cards. I have a honeymoon packing checklist. And then I have a name change checklist, which is so important. Like I cannot even begin to think everything I'm gonna have to change my name on. They do have this like program where um, you like put your information and they change your name everywhere for you. But I still have to do some research on that to see if I'm gonna use it. But this is gonna be so helpful because I don't even know like where to change my name besides for like the basic things oh i'm so happy this is so helpful so that's everything that was in my last miss to mrs box this was by far my favorite box out of all of them it's kind of bittersweet because it's the last box and i'm sad that i don't have any more to unbox but they had a lot of good stuff in this box like i'm really i'm really happy that i did this it kind of made it all come together i see myself using every single thing in this box this time so Definitely recommend getting a Mr. Miss Box subscription. Um, like I said, by the time you guys see this, will be a week away from our wedding. So my wedding series will be ending pretty shortly. I am gonna be filming the week of the wedding and hopefully the day of the wedding, depending on how that goes. But that is my plan as of right now. So hopefully I can get those videos out for you guys. I also will be filming a video with Lavelle prior to the wedding about the things that we're excited for and what we're nervous for so definitely make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss any of my wedding series videos and i will see you guys in my next video bye no friends of mine no friends of mine around yeah now i'm thinking now i'm thinking now by the cottage